One of the most useful features of Speechify is being able to import Word documents, text files, and PDFs from places like Google Docs, iClouds, or Dropbox. So here's how you do that. Click on the Import button in the bottom left corner. I'll just click iCloud. Uh, here I have a Harry Potter fan fiction book that I want to listen to that I'm really excited about. Um, and I notice that there's page numbers here in the bottom. And that's annoying because I don't want to hear the page number every time. So I'm going to crop it out like that. And then I'll say, uh, crop all pages, apply. So now every single page of the book has the page number cropped out so I don't need to listen to the page number every single time. I also see that it has the chapter name at the top and I don't want that either. either. Crop all pages, apply. So now, that means that every page from now on is going to have the top and the bottom cropped out and only the text in the middle will be read. So I'm going to click done, create, and what it'll do is it'll break up the book for me into multiple parts. Google Drive and Dropbox work pretty similar. All you need to do is go into import and either click Dropbox or Google Drive. Make sure that you're signed in. If you want to have Dropbox work for you, you have to make sure that you have the Dropbox app on your phone. Uh, and then I can really pull in anything I'd like. This workflow is super useful, especially if you're a student and you already know all your readings for the semester. You can just make a folder with all your readings at once. If you're a professional and there's a series of uh, documents or reports you need to read, you can do this as well. And that's how to use Speechify to import PDFs, Word documents, text files from Google Drive, Dropbox, or iCloud.